Yeah. Natural mother. Okay, where are we in the timeline? Arizona, right, okay. Our time in Arizona came to an end and it was time to get on a plane and head to sunny California. No, sunny California. No, sunny, Ugh, forget it. It was time to visit Colin's sister and her husband and our niece and nephew in Los Angeles. <laughs> so did you take everything out of the freezer and now you're putting it all back? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Much different vibe here. Staying as guests at my sister in law's house. But it's been a full day, and jet lag is catching up to me. We're bringing back the coffee porch morning. Morning coffee, outside porch. Cause it's over 50 degrees and there are palm trees. Are there any more with sky? Maybe this one? That's got some blue in it. You can find a spot for that one though. You gotta, you gotta find this, the blue, right? So it's, it might be up here somewhere. Try lining it up with that one, maybe. I think we got a match. We did. Woo! Yes. Did you know LA had a train? Cause I didn't. Colin and I went on an adults only adventure down to the Santa Monica Pier. So have you thought about where you want to eat? How about right there? We're going to sit on the porch? Yeah. Whoa, look at this wave. Hmm? Look at this wave. They're huge. After an amazing lunch, we decided to head down to the beach to walk off the extra calories from all the tacos we've been eating. Oh, we gotta see what the water's all about. I'm gonna go ahead and turn down the music here and give you some ocean sounds because the Pacific Ocean just hits different. Wow. Huh? 
the blinders on. Yeah. Is it cold? Yeah. It's not too bad. No, it really isn't. After our short-lived beach time, we got a craving for boardwalk funnel cakes. And ended the day with a beautiful West Coast sunset. Are you breaking through the egg? We wanted to do something family oriented with the kids, so we decided to head over to the Museum of Natural History. Park right now. <laughs> oh, trigger warning the next few moments contain some bugs. Check out the timestamps below. is the larva, and in the cocoon is the pupa. That is intense.
oh this is my favorite part the rock and mineral room and guys i'm just gonna let you look because there is nothing i can say to do these crystals justice there was so much to gawk at but we left the kids with colin's sister so we didn't have much time but what we saw oh, just take a look Trigger warning for one more bug. Yeah. We definitely worked up an appetite for tacos at the end of the day. Today's our last day. It makes me sad because I don't want to go home. On the other hand, the past few days have been full of playing with children and I am exhausted. After three days, three days of playing with children, exhausted. I don't know how you parents do it. I really don't. Anyway, let's go to the park. Are your legs long enough? Not quite. There you go. Hey! You yeah! Your legs right there? That's so you can exercise your muscles. I think right there. Hey, Snoopy. 
Uncle Colin really worked up an appetite with all that yard work. And then, sadly, it was time to pack, as we had a flight that evening. I still have this thing. Luckily, we still had time for a few more bedtime stories, and Colin picked the saddest book ever. And he would gather her leaves. Remember what that means? Yeah. <laughs> what does it mean? When they fall to the ground, she picks them up. Exactly. I should mention I also have a niece. Yeah. Natural mother. <laughs> oh, and what they say about LA traffic, it's all true. And that's goodbye, California, from the sad middle seat. Contrast of yesterday versus today. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs>